hello dear people i hope you all are doing well so uh, today i am creating this video to answer the queries on like uh, how i joined publicis sapien uh, actually since last uh, few months i was getting a uh, lots of dms on the linkedin like uh, uh, what is the process to join the publicis sapien and uh, uh, what are the different types of rounds that way they are taking to put uh, any candidate placed actually i joined publicis sapien few months back but uh, i was uh, busy through some other processes so i didn't got a chance to create a videos yet but uh, yes today finally i got some time and so i thought let's create a video on the processes so basically uh, uh, at the time of interviewing i had uh, uh, interviewed uh, uh, around i think two rounds were there i'm don't remember exactly but yeah two to three rounds were there uh, initially uh, the recruiter called me via telephone uh, basically i was uh, i applied uh, through one of my friends referrals so uh, he referred me uh, at the publicity segment so the after two to three days uh, i got one call from the recruiter and then uh, she asked me some basic details like uh, what text text currently i am working on and what is my years of experience and all those some basic details uh, she had asked me then after 2 uh, to 3 days uh, she called me again then uh, she was asking me to uh, schedule the interview so yes i given her my availability and then uh, she scheduled interview the next day then uh, the first round was basically regarding the react js round uh, so Uh, basically i had uh, i applied as a front end uh, react js developer at the publicis sapient then uh, uh, in the first round uh, the round was basically regarding the live coding round then the interviewer uh, uh, first of all asked me some uh, basic questions of the react like uh, what is virtual dom then uh, what is diffing algorithm then how react works behind the picture and Uh, how it's uh, uh, working and what are the uses of keys and all that stuff then uh, after that uh, uh, she uh, has given me one uh, live coding in which uh, i just need to uh, complete one task uh, task given by her uh, the task was about crud operation nothing else the, so yes i completed the task then after that uh, she asked me about uh, some uh, latest react hooks and what are the uses of different types of hooks so i answered the hook uh, questions of them then uh, after that uh, uh, yeah then that round was completed that round was uh, around 1 hour i guess then after uh, uh, one days then i received an email from the recruiter like uh, Uh, i was sort listed uh, i cleared the first round then she called me again then uh, she scheduled one uh, another round uh, with the uh, manager round yes the first round basically it was with the senior uh, uh, developer and then the second and final round was uh, uh, with the manager then uh, uh, she yes she scheduled my round uh, with the manager and then in that round ara uh, was around 1 to 1.5 hours long in that round uh, the interviewer asked me all the basic details about the html css and javascript and uh, react as well so uh, he started with the uh, html first then he asked me different types of basic html like uh, what is the semantic tags then uh, what is the use of header and footer then what is accessibility and all that stuff then after that uh, he started to ask me about the css like uh, uh, which are the css uh, framework that i worked on what is sas what is less and uh, then uh, he given me one uh, task as well A little uh, that was uh, that was not so hard it was just to uh, confirm the css syntax then after that uh, he comes around the javascript then he asked me about the javascript questions like uh, what is uh, a call stack was it uh, what is event loop and how javascript works uh, behind the browser and uh, what is the closure then call bind and apply and all the basic javascript stuff and after that uh, he asked me about the react 
then in the react uh, since the basic details was uh, initially completed uh, completed with the first round so he started asking with the some advanced level java uh, react js concepts then uh, see, uh, he asked me about uh, what is the state management then uh, which are the different types of libraries that i worked on so yes i uh, gave him answer uh, like i worked with uh, tons of libraries uh, for example uh, redux redux saga mobex and flux are also there then after that uh, he asked me like uh, uh, which are the projects that you worked on and then I uh, explained one of my projects that I worked on then yeah then the interview was completed and then uh, two to three days after that uh, I received uh, uh, one another call from the recruiter like uh, I am selected and then at last the HR round was had and then in the HR round uh, like uh, the basic details nothing else like communication and then over discussion and all the other things as well like uh, uh, she told me about the work culture at the public recipient and all that details so yes after that uh, i received an email like uh, i am hired and then after that a uh, few few days after that i joined public recipient and yeah that's it so I hope that I answered all of your questions and still if you have any queries or any uh, questions arise in your mind later then you can definitely reach me out via any social media platform. I already given links to all my social media platform in the description box. So yeah you can ping me anytime and I will definitely answer your questions. So yeah that was it and I also uh, while I inter I was being interviewed at the publicist recipient. Then I was uh, holding basically uh, offer from another two to three MNCs as well, like JP Morgan, Cognizant, and EPAM, and then Infosys as well. So I will definitely try to create the different uh, videos on that as well, so that uh, any new candidate which is uh, getting interviewed for the first time at uh, any MNC, so that uh, he or she can get uh, more ideas on that as well. So yes, I will definitely create uh, some videos on that part as well and then I will also give some my interview experience on that person as well. So yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching.